apologies for the length of this video. It's longer than I generally like to make, but 10.9 showed a lot of great stuff. I put through a lot of stress tests and it's definitely the best build yet and showing a lot of improvement. Please use the timestamps to jump to any parts you find of interest. Welcome FSD Beta Geeks 10.9 in play, aggressive mode. This is my first turn now left. Turn left onto Garmin Road. We got a lot of snow, so the roads are a little narrower here. Got a car coming from the right. I'm gonna have to wait for that unless it's gonna be real aggressive. And that's pretty bad. It was gonna creep out to the road and that car was fairly close to me. So that was not a good start on 10.9. Good smooth, that's probably the smoothest lefts I've made at this turn before. All right, good speed coming into the turn. Nice, a tiny little jerk of the steering wheel, but very nice. They came in um, really good speed, human-like speed to that. So that was a nice. The biggest improvement in 10.9 at this unprotected blind left is how the car is now creeping forward, far up to the road where it needs to be. In previous iterations, the car would stop back at the stop sign and then creep up and before it could see, it would just take off blindly. The car kind of stalled there, right, in the turn. Good creep, terrible execution after the creep. Let's do that one more time. All right, I'm staying a little more right this time. I'm leaving enough room on the left. You can see all these bushes here. Cars to the right. Okay, car to the left. It's gonna creep some more. Right's clear, left's not, can't go. Left cannot go, right's clear. Okay, it's waiting. Okay, Ooh. okay, I let it go. It kind of crept the forward there with that car coming. Made the left turn. This time much faster and smoother than the first time when the car was coming at me. So that was very good. All right, let's do it one more time. I don't know if it's seeing these salt lines as, as lanes potentially. Okay, now it can't see to the left. Got all these bushes. It's crept up. It's stopping like it wants to go. It's a little jerky. It's okay. It's correcting back to the right. That's good. All right, that's a fail. Here's that car. I was going to go for it. All right, that was not good. All right. Why can you not see that car? It's right there. All right, so we stopped again way too far back. Stop signs back there. We stopped for the first time further ahead. All right, good creeping here. All right, All right good acceleration. All right, so there were no cars coming. That was really easy for it. This will be attempt number five. What's interesting is it's not stopping at the stop sign. It used to stop at the stop sign and then creep, but now it seems to go past the stop sign and stop for the first time. See, it's stopping further ahead of the stop, but it still needs to go much further to creep, so it still can't see. There comes a car. Okay, so nobody's coming again. All right, so it made it there. Again, no cars coming. Creeping is definitely better, but the decision making when it's going to go, even with cars coming, is not great still. So, but I need to get some cars to challenge it more. Last couple times there have been you no know, cars coming. Okay, again it's stopping. This time it stopped at the stop sign further back. Okay, I don't see any cars through the bushes. It's gonna have to creep way up. Nothing from the right. It's gonna creep up and stop and go. Again, no cars are coming. Definitely better with no cars coming. It's still not too great with cars coming in its decision-making process, so. Got some snow creeping on the right, so the car's being cautious here, this car, that's going to proceed. This is now our really difficult left and right, and it's a Saturday afternoon, so it should be lots of traffic, so. This is gonna be an amazing test if 10.9 can pull this off. So we got this building on the left that the car has to look past. They got traffic coming from the right. It's gonna see my it's gonna now see one to creep out there too far. So let's call that a fail. Got the building on the left, it has to creep out past, but then it's gotta watch for the traffic on the right. It's going to try and make get into there's two lanes, it needs to get into the far lane on the right and then make an immediate right. There's a car coming, it stopped for it, good. If it can go now, it can make it. There's no traffic anywhere. No traffic anywhere, go. It's creeping so slowly. 
way too slowly, but it made it. That's the first time it's ever made this turn, but the steering wheel is really jerky here. Um, but I don't, why is it so slow? It's no traffic coming in either direction. The car has to be able to see left and right when it's that far out and it's still not going. I just do not understand that. We do have snow on the right here, which might present a problem. It's gotta make a right turn, it's really jerky. All right, it's struggling to make this right. In the past, it's made this right very easily, and I think that snow is really throwing it off for a loop. I'm gonna report that too. Next attempt, we've got some cars up here, which is hopefully good to stress test this. Okay, great, we've got a lot of cars here. We've got, we've got the traffic light, which is perfect. So, can't see to the left, it's gotta creep. Okay, nothing's to the left, the traffic is halted. I got a car in the right. Okay, now it can't, I gotta go, I gotta go. Come on, all right, perfect, great, 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 good. Good, that's the best it's done. All right, Ugh, really jerky, the snow is really throwing it off, I think, on the right side there. Again, it's never had a problem with these, um, that right there before, but I think the snow is really throwing it. Let's see if I make this sharp left turn here. All right, that was nice. All right, good, okay, that was a good, that was a sharp turn. We've now got a car in front of us making a right. We'll be making this left here. Nobody behind this, so we have time to let this go. All right, it's got to creep up. Nothing from the left or right. Now's a perfect time to go. Well, it's hard because there are some trees. Okay, you can see how... All right, it actually made it. That car coming at us was a little iffy. Now I'm kind of sticking out with my ass kind of in the middle of the left lane. I wanna, I wanna coast up just a little bit to help it correct itself here. So I'm gonna let that truck go by. Cause I would have been, I think my butt is still, no, I'm in the lane, but not great. All right, here we go. Let's see if the car can make this turn. All right, this time much smoother on that turn. So something changed. I don't know if I was in a different geometry <clears throat> thinking about these trees there's trees on the right of me that might be hurting its visibility to the right now we can't see to the left again still can, we can no way we can see the right it's got to creep but now it should hopefully be able to see uh, i think those trees on the right are giving it a hard time i'm in the wrong lane and missed the lane all right so i'm going to go through traffic so it totally missed the lane that time. That's strange. All right, another attempt. It gets, it's better than it has been. It's not perfect, of course, but it's definitely better on 10.9 than it's been in the past. All right, so it's, there's no way you can see. It's got a creep, got a lot of traffic coming, got a car turning, car coming from the left and the right. Okay, I think these trees really are giving it a hard time. Go. Okay, good. Get in the right lane. Come on, go get the right. Get in the right lane. Come on, go. Go. Get in the right lane. There you go. Hey, hey. All right. That was pretty good. That was one of the better times to weave through all that traffic. So that was, in some ways, a very interesting attempt. Okay. Here we go. Going a little slow. Come on. Okay. All right, something it didn't like there. So that snow is proving difficult sometimes for the car to make that turn. So I want to point out straight ahead of us in front of this car, you see to the left of this car, there is a big tree and it lines the street. So when I'm making these lefts, we make this turn, you'll see this tree straight ahead here, these, these row of trees. I think it's providing uh, some difficulty for the beta to see down the road potentially. Um, you got to get past this building up here that's on our left here, mustard seed, and then you have to see past those trees. So
So this is a really, really challenging set of turns for the car, I think. Again, remember we got these trees on the right that we, I think, are blocking. The building on the left, it's going to have to creep up here. Okay, when the truck, truck, truck is turning, it's going to have to stop for that truck. And I've got traffic. This is a good one because i got this car waiting for me back here potentially. Is he going to wait for me? No. I want to go up. So the car... Oh, see, now i got traffic coming and I'm blocked. So that's where... That was a fail. That was a good stress test right there. And the car needed to be aggressive, but it really had nowhere to go essentially because this car was up and he's even a human driver i'm kind of blocking the road if i turn the back camera on i don't know if we can see i got a car behind me here i've got this car on the left pulling in the left turn lane so this is just kind of a mess for a human being this this set of turns is a mess so for fsd beta to do something like this is going to be pretty amazing all right probably our last attempt today Let's see if we get lucky get some decent traffic to hamper us uh it's wide open totally wide open got a car coming down the road a little bit not too not too close and the car is struggling to get in the right lane and it's stuck here and i got a car behind me got the turn signal on let's see if it can make it i'm going to press the accelerator Okay, so the car got stuck there, but after I pressed the accelerator a little bit, it got itself in the right lane, but it couldn't get there by itself. It's a unprotected left turn, so I can't see from the left because of the pine trees. It's right is open. It's got to creep a little bit more. Okay. Again, it got out into the middle and hesitated just a teeny bit. This is going to be an unprotected right turn. Uh, I can't see. It's going to have to creep up. Okay, I should be able to see on the left now. Okay, I can see the traffic. A little, little fast, a little jerky fast, but it made it. Got a car coming here. Just going to have to wait for it. Good. I've got a yellow light and it's going to miss it. So we're going to let that go. So if the car had the creeping behavior to go out into the road, we would have made that left turn, but the car couldn't seem to pull that off. I right, got the green light, got cars coming. And now it's kind of in the middle of the road. That was bad. It, uh, couldn't decide what I wanted to do. It was like a deer frozen in the headlights. All right, good. That was a good one. All right. Nobody coming. Got one car on the other side. Who's going straight through? Okay. We have not had any cars to challenge us on the traffic circle. And so far, it's been smooth two out of three times. Or two out of two, I think it was. So it's stopping far back, but okay. Good. Good. This is so far the best traffic circle behavior the car has ever done. That was nice. Very nice. Nice and smooth. All right, got a little bit of traffic coming. Great. All right, very nice. That was uh, really nice. 
was having a hard time at seeing this right as a term, but it's not. Kind of confused it a little bit. Now we'll make a right on red here. I wonder. Crept up there. A little weird. That truck coming. Start, okay, it's going to go. I got a car turning right. Thinks like it wants to go. Another car turning right. Now it can go right on red if it. I'm going to push the accelerator right. It's kind of. I don't know what it's thinking it's trying to do there. Alright, let's see if I can get me into the Aldi parking lot. It's going to have to start getting over pretty soon. I got a car coming up on my left. It's going to turn the signal on good. Very nice. In the past, it didn't get over this soon. There's two ways into this. It always seems to take the unofficial way in, which is fine. There's like this, it's not a service road per se, but it's some kind of a, an ancillary road that goes into the parking lot. It looks like it's going to try and take that road this time, which is fine. All right, a little jerky there. All right, after this car can go. Great. All right, come on, you can do it. All right, good. I got somebody behind me. Okay. All right, a little jerky getting in there, but it's made itself into the parking lot. All right, we've got to merge to the highway here. In the past, we've gotten blocked out by cars coming off the interstate. We got lucky this time, but it also pre-planned much better and got to the right lane much sooner, a couple traffic lights back, which was good. So this was a nice, smooth entry. In the past, sometimes I would get into these on-ramps and the car would slow down instead of accelerating through the turns. So here it stayed really nice consistent speed all the way through the turn and then as we get up towards the highway we'll start to see it start to accelerate and then it's going to smoothly flow into traffic here we go we're ramping up ramping up speed and really don't have any issues to contend with with cars so it's a pretty easy merge but definitely an improvement seems like it's less jerky getting off the highway as well. Sometimes you would like jerk over an autopilot. No, no, no. All right, here we've got, here's a classic example. There's, there's actually two lanes. I'm going to disengage because there's a guy on my right. I want him to go over. There's only one lane here, but it's really two lanes. So I'm gonna mark that one because that's, an issue where there's no lane lines there and it's a local knowledge there's two lanes there. I engaged it a little late to remap it so usually it's been in this wanted to be in this right lane so I don't know if I precluded that from happening. When I've been in the right lane it really wants to jerk into the left lane but this time it took it much smoother and decided to stop there. I'm gonna I'm kind of in the intersection there a little bit. I'm gonna back up. So the car probably should have gone for it there. It was uh, now I'm kind of on the intersection, but I can't just I can't engage FSD. Didn't see any lane lines, so. That was probably needed to handle a little bit better. Okay. Again, as a human, I probably would have gone out into the intersection more. It's making the left though. All right, pretty smooth. Just a teeny bit of jerk, but pretty good overall. Thanks for sticking to the end if you made it this far. Kudos to the FSD beta team. They really put some nice work into this build. Traffic circles are so much better. The creeping's better. Definitely still lots of work to do, but it's great to see that rate of improvement since I've had it since 10.2.